back. Okay, so I've gone there. Now I want to look at, let's see if I can find downloads. Where, and Opera seems kind of responsive in a way, because, it, it, but it almost feels like you can feel the program load and the software downloading. It's just kind of nuts. Okay, where is Flash? Oh, there's Flash. Ugh. Ugh. I'm tired. Um, See, so I already have Flash. Now, the thing in Windows, you have to have a different installation of Flash for both Mozilla and Internet Explorer, but why would why would I need it here? Why? Okay, so it doesn't think I just don't know. It doesn't. It doesn't seem to think I have it installed. I guess the best way to find out actually is to go to YouTube. Then I'll know whether it thinks it's got it in there. It certainly isn't detecting it at the, the Adobe site, but it may not be geared towards that. Well, I'll find out in a second. No, okay, so Flash is in there. So the <laughs> the answer at the end of the day for now it could be because these updates were downloading that Opera wasn't responding, but as far as I know. Um, Opera just isn't going to work at all with Pogo. But I shouldn't say that because guess what? I'm always wrong with this damn thing. <laughs> hey guys, so I made a lyric video for my new song, What Does It Take? While I work on the actual video, I've never made a lyric. Okay, signed in. Come on. See, so I still got some internet traffic here coming in that are. Um, doing this update. I've got almost all 34 megabytes now further. Why is this not responding? Probably because I'm doing a download. It's going pretty fast. But I'm only about 3 megabytes away. Not happening. Now I can do all these other fancy things. I could delete the .java folder and the dot pulse folder just for opera and restart opera just for that which is what I'll do just to, just to be fair to the opera bork man <laughs> now that's going better my balloon bounce seems like in certain ways it's like really respond oh what what's it doing respond delay are you bored yet <laughs> okay all, all these different updates are installing there's the only real noticeable impact on the system is because I have you know I could download It'll download the programs as fast as it's able to, and so therefore, you know, it's going to take up some bandwidth, and the other things I'm trying to use won't. Now, I did some during this update. I did something to Pulse Audio, but I don't, I don't know what that is. I guess I could see if it made a difference. Uh, the guy that wrote Pulse Audio wrote a blog. He said that Ubuntu doesn't get it. Ubuntu doesn't get it. So. Um, that folder again. I don't have a pulse folder. Okay, that's fine. Come on. Apply your changes. And are we done? There are no updates installed. Let's close that sucker. Now let's see if there's any difference. I think Firefox was updated, which means it'll probably work worse. And let's go back to Pogo. Opera just seems like it's non-functional in Ubuntu. That version of Opera 
this version of Java, this Pogo, just doesn't work. Try Lentos by Solar Star. Get your drugs now. It's an insulin pin. Da da da. Okay, when is this damn thing gonna end? I guess I have to scroll down to the bottom for the game to start. And wait for it to scroll on by. We have sound. Game is loading. Let's see if I get my freaking cutesy song. No, I don't. Do I get any kind of... Nothing. <laughs> oh, there's something. This is something. This is nothing. So, no resolutions today. Uh, we have absolutely no explanation as to why your sound isn't working. Pulse audio update apparently didn't make any difference. Um, for certain that I can tell you that um, Opera has its problems. Sea Monkey may or may not make a difference. Deleting your dot pulse folder may or may not make a difference. Deleting your dot Java folder may or may may not make a difference. Renaming your uh, Java else a plugin may or may may or may not, but most likely will not make a difference. Uh, causing Pulse to start to start and inject itself into Java will probably cause your Java to freeze on you as you start it. So uh, renaming the Java binary and creating a script yourself hasn't hasn't worked for me. Obviously, it worked for somebody, or there's some clown out there that <laughs> has put up a joke and people are perpetuating it. Who knows? Um, that's it. Okay, now I'm going to do a short little thing on casework.